Hello there and welcome back. I woke up this morning with a little bit of a sore throat, so if I sound a little weird or funny, you know why. Went out last night, had some very hot chicken wings late. I think I burned my throat. Anyway, let's get to the good, uh, good stuff, good news. I debated about uh, doing um, a video like this. It's um, I've done best of best distros before. I've 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 taken polls for you to choose the best Linux distro for that specific year. And this, you know, this thing of about a best Linux desktop can vary from hardware to hardware. You know, many many bad things can happen in a Linux desktop, and many good things can happen. It really does vary from from hardware to uh, hardware. But I installed the Ubuntu Mate, the latest one, Alpha 2, in this Toshiba satellite uh, 305. This this uh, satellite uh, laptop had originally had Vista, and that's how uh, that's how long ago it was. But I installed the Alpha 2, didn't have any issues, and it's been uh, it's been running pretty good, all things considered. A few crashes uh, here and there. That's expected for an Alpha 2, but. I was expecting a lot more problems and in the two weeks of testing this it really hasn't been that bad uh, very impressive so I mean I've always liked the Mate desktop you, you guys know that I've always liked Linux Mint Mate Ubuntu Mate but this one here so far seems to work pretty good of course like I said it is an alpha so unless you have a spare machine like I do I probably would not install this yeah, I probably would not install this for everyday use. It's great for testing, like like what I'm doing. Uh, I installed um, I installed a couple pieces of software. Let's see, I installed Clementine, a music player, a great music player for Linux, and uh, I installed uh, let's see, so oh, simple screen recorder to record it, and then um, a few other things like Radio Tray and something else, uh, Brave browser. But so far, this has been, for an Alpha 2, a very impressive piece of software. Martin Wimpress, the lead developer for Ubuntu Mate, has done a terrific job. You may want to check out my uh, interview I did with him. It's been two years now, uh, and how Ubuntu Mate was created. I did ask him, and I affectionately call this the Romantic OS. I won't spoil it, but go ahead and take a listen to that uh, interview. Uh, and you'll know why I call it that. But uh, as far as this goes, like I said, a couple bugs uh, here and there. But Ubuntu Mate, all things considered, I've tested many, many distros. And, you know, Total OS today has been primarily a channel for, <clears throat> primarily a channel for beginners, newbies. It's evolved into much more than that over the years, but primarily a channel for beginners, a, a, a starting point for people to uh, technology or Linux that don't know where to get started. And so hopefully many of you, or some of you I know got your start here into the world of Linux, so thank you. But if you like what you see, I would download the previous version, uh, Ubuntu Mate Linux, um, uh, the 17.04. Give it a shot, <clears throat> give it a shot and let me know what you think. But Ubuntu Mate, is my Linux desktop for 2017. It's always looked good, it's always been great for beginners, and this really continues, continues its, its um, evolving excellence, the best way to describe this for a Linux desktop. And this just gets better and better. So welcome to Ubuntu Mate. If this is your first time here at the channel, welcome to Total OS Today, Total Technology for Beginners and Beyond. Again, I apologize for my throat, but that being said, if you haven't already, subscribe and support this Total OS Today technology channel. That's it for this one. I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.